time we took it over, they only served lunch, and it was a, a lawyer who owned it, and he pulled it out. And I remember sitting down with him, his name is Jesse, he's still a lawyer in Baltimore. I said, Jesse, he said, why do you want out? He said, because my wife is threatening to leave me if I don't decide to leave. He said, he said, I'm working too many hours. He said, I'm ready to go back to law. So that should have been a red flag, right? It should have been a red flag. But it wasn't because I was young and ambitious and I didn't have, you know, I didn't have a family in terms of kids and a wife. I was, you know. So for me, it was an opportunity. So we moved forward and bought it and um, immediately we started trying to rethink um, the, the restaurant in terms of how we can market it differently. Um, his food was good. And we, we liked the menu. Fundamentally, it was a white cloth establishment. We could see about 150 people. There were two levels. Um, very beautiful, uh, historic building with 10C. 